Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by. And you got here to, you caught me camping, of all things. I'm in site number 38 at Lake Tawakini State Park. I, I have returned for good reason. On my previous visit, it was the dead of winter. It was really cold and miserable. And I was by myself. I didn't have Yappy or the, or the Ratty Pack. They're with, they have joined me on this journey. We're here primarily to practice. Uh, not practice camping, but practice working virtually through Starlink. And Yappy had not been to this campground. So here we are to see it in the green of spring and have an opportunity to work remotely. What we're gonna do, I'm gonna walk you through the park anyway. It's site number 38, it's a handicap site. Very level concrete pad. And this is a full connection. Actually Lake Tawakini has a lot of full connection sites. Water, 30 amp, in sewer. And the sewer's back over here, so that 20 foot of hose that I bought would be ideal, but there's our shower. There's Yappy, hi Yappy, and Ziva. So we got the arrays up, the perfect Perfect view of the sky for Starlink, which is one of the reasons I picked this site. Wooden picnic table on a concrete pad. We have, we can camp now. We have the ubiquitous lantern hook. Fire pit. I have some firewood that I found. And kind of kind of right here in our front yard is the other handicap site. But it's, it's Sunday. I don't anticipate seeing anybody in the next two days. All right, well, let's go see some stuff. Let's go check out Lake Tawakini State Park. You got a duck when you see the branches. So we're gonna whoo, try to cross over to, whoo, because there's steps. We'll try to get over the day use area. Won't be coming back this way. Those bumps are bad. We're gonna go see some stuff, some Lake Tawakini stuff. So one of the things that Lake Tawakini has that a lot of your Corps of Engineer campgrounds does not is a actual beach for swimming. Now, there is no lifeguard, so you do have to swim at your own risk. But there's a lot of people. And then there is a three-laner boat ramp. And it looks like they've got a really, really great courtesy dock. A little bit crowded today, though. Let's go find some more stuff. They have kayaks available for rental. And you can rent them right there. Swipe the card and you're boating away. So Lake Tawakini has a beautiful, beautiful day use area. Wow, last time I was here, I actually fished right over there. So if you wanna go camp, uh, have a picnic without having to camp out, come to the day use area. Uh, 
not a pavilion, but a, what is that? A stage? An auto, not an auditorium. What am I trying to say? Anyway, they, they put on nature programs right there. There's quite a few hiking trails out here as well. And one of the claims to fame is the giant spider web. But you can see all, all read all about that on Google. I have not seen it personally. Apparently there's a colony of spiders that builds this giant spider web. All right, let's go see some more stuff. Well, Lake Tawakini does feature a fishing pond. So you can bring the kiddos over here and, and let them catch some, some fish. Some little perch and crappie maybe. A little catfish. It looks like they have a very well maintained dump station. But no chemical dumping. And don't drink the water. It's nasty. One of the great things about Lake Tawakini State Park are the campsites, the RV campsites. Man, just look at this one. I don't even know what number it is, but it is so private. There's a big screen of trees between you and that side over there. And the same is true for that side over there. It's actually site number seven. There's no water access that I can tell, but it's still a great campsite. Took me a little bit, but I finally got on the water this morning. See if we can find us some crappie. I have a dozen minutes for a dozen fish. So I'm in about 10 feet of water. I'm on the south side of the peninsula where our camp is. And I'm, I'm seeing a lot of movement of fish on the fish finder, but there's schools moving through here. I haven't found a good solid brush pile yet. Oop, gotta go. Got one online. Ooh, he's a big one too. Feels like a big one. We'll see when we get in closer to the boat. I think it's a catfish. Oh yeah. That's a snag too. Didn't even, didn't even get to taste it. Ha, <laughs> 
That's a good one. Not bad. Not too bad. For a drum, of course, I don't like going to keep the drum. Another drum. They must be spawning up in this cove or something. They're kind of fun to catch. So yesterday was Mother's Day, Sunday. What an amazing difference that one day makes. Now we can truly appreciate how grown up the beach is. <laughs> Without all those people there, we can see that it's not much of a beach. All right, let's go see what else we can get into. He's out of the water. Now, the last time I was at Lake Tawakini State Park, I was gonna give this a, I was gonna try to get out of here, but it was just so muddy. Right, there's the continuation of the nature trail, but here is the group primitive site. There's a big fire pit, picnic tables, trash cans, and lots of lantern hooks. So you'll be able to camp in total coolness. In case you're wondering, now the, the, the main reason that we have come out to Lake Tawakini to spend a couple of days camping, number one is Yappy's 
new virtual position and testing Starlink to see how that works out. And this campsite actually turned out to be the ideal location for Starlink because we don't have any trees facing to the north. Even though I like a well shaded site, this one's got plenty of western shade. Well, most importantly, the Starlink is working fantastic. Now we have we have AT&T fiber at base camp. And when she's doing the virtual world real estate thing and then I'm doing the YouTube thing, we really start to choke down on that 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 fiber, believe it or not. That, that for some reason that virtual world really takes up a lot of bandwidth. But she has not had any issues with just being solo. I'm not doing any YouTube stuff. But she's had no problems at all with Starlink. That's what I'm trying to say, with Starlink. So that's real promising. We're going we're gonna to do another practice run, another another shakedown run next weekend we're gonna go see if we can spot a deer three of them. You can see the silhouette right there. to have a fawn. She's, she's real pregnant. I don't know if you can see this one right there. That was pretty cool. These are uh, a little more skittish than some of the Texas state parks that I've been to, where they just stand there and look at you. What are you doing? So, looks like I'm having to cut the, the visit to Lake Tawakany. Bug in my mouth. Having to cut the visit short to Lake Tawakany State Park. Just got a call. My mother's in the hospital. So I gotta, we're, we're, we're breaking camp. First, I'm rolling out here first thing in the morning. I'm headed south. Uh, Yappy's, she still has to work tomorrow, so she's loaded up and taking the truck and the ratty pack, and she's going to RV home base. And then we're going to reconvene later in the week. We've got plans to go somewhere this coming weekend, but it's all up in the air right now. So I'm going to go ahead and close this out. There's there's not much left for me to do here other than finish packing up what little bit I have left, eat supper, get clean, download some video, empty the cameras, uh, and get ready to roll out of here first light tomorrow. So I appreciate you guys stopping by. If you're still with me at this point, thank you so much. I'm, I'm most I'm most grateful for that. If you've not already, I uh, would be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, so this, this, this right here 
this is this is what for you this is why i do what i do thank you so much i'm i, I really appreciate that and for my patrons gotta have some light here where's the light oh there's the light for my patrons thank you so much i am most appreciative you guys rock all right y'all come back now you hear